All right, so today in this video, we are going to be rebuilding this Ingersoll Rand T30 air compressor pump. Uh, I picked this guy up for free with uh, this little ball door motor, three horse, and uh, the tank as well, all for free. Uh, this pump currently only turns about a quarter way uh, because it was left outside for three years. A lot of water got in here. So um, I'm gonna be taking it apart and um, just gonna be rebuilding it. Hopefully I won't have to purchase any parts. Uh, right now I'm just gonna try to hone the cylinders, see if the piston rings are in good shape. Uh, just remove the rust from the reed valves. And uh, yeah, so I'll start opening it up. All right, so getting this first head off here. I cracked it open. Okay. So a good amount of corrosion in here. The reed valves. Very, very dirty. So I'll uh, just have to unscrew them all and uh, just clean them up with a wire brush. So this is what the cylinder looks like on the inside. Uh, yeah, so uh, full of water. Uh, I mean, it sucks, but you know, it is what it is. So to take off the sheave, just have to loosen that bolt there and uh, just to start hitting it off. I don't have a puller, which would be ideal, but you can see uh, that bit of uh, shine uh, that's uh, where the pulley was so you know the hammer's working it's obviously not ideal but it's working so once the sheave is off I'm gonna move the pump All right, so what I'm doing now is taking off these cooling uh, fins, with the, the tubes. Uh, so I have to, in order to counter hold, I have to remove this fitting and this guy here because uh, my wrench doesn't fit. It's just in order to counter hold, but so I'm taking everything out. So here, 15, 16, so just, Taking it off. So once I take these all off, um, start filming again and uh, probably take off the uh, cylinders next. All right, now I'm going to take off the cylinder head uh, and the cylinder, and then we'll take off both cylinders actually, and see the uh, condition of the connecting rods and the crank. So, uh, not great news, but I mean, <laughs> it is what it is, I guess. Uh, I mean, having sat outside for three years, uh, sure did collect a good amount of water. I should have done this to start because uh, when I was taking out one of the head bolts, I mean uh, the cylinder bolts, 
uh, it just started leaking water everywhere and I got it all over my uh, my desk but managed to clean it up quick quick yeah. So yeah, here's all the oil coming out now just got it going into a uh, makeshift bucket yeah I mean at least there was oil <laughs> 